after last trip's success and a rumour of a fish over twice the size of the one I caught, I have to go back in search of this monster. This time, however, the weather is not in my favour. gear packed and ready to go at a set off. After hours of research and planning, I have an idea as to where I want to fish. However, with the freezing cold conditions, I know it's not going to be easy this time. over farmland, this spot drops off into deep water directly in front of me, with a shallower area to the left providing the perfect winter location for big pike. In winter, these Scottish lochs can drop to extreme temperatures, and the pike will look for areas of slightly warmer water. The running water that runs through the farms and built-up areas is often slightly warmer during the winter months. Similarly, the shallow areas of these lochs can be warmed in the sun meaning there is often a short window where the pike move into the shallows to feed. positioned I sit back and watch the world move by as various waterfowl make their way past my camp. At this time of year the fishing can be slow with the fish less active so one of the things I like to do is use oil to bring the fish to me. Many of the Scottish locks have salmon running through them and as they come to the end of their life cycle they die, providing an easy food source for the pike. Which is why today I rejected my baits with salmon oil. After a couple of hours of waiting, I get my first run. Big fish. This is a really big fish. Just a solid weight. Let's get her unhooked. Looks like a nice fish. Perfectly hooked, right in the scissors. Just get her unhooked now, actually. Hooked out. 
Here's his hat. I want to get my lamprey back. Come on. Just had a big meal, this fish. Our stomach has got a big trout or something in there. Beautiful fish. Put away now. It's not something in its stomach. It's obviously just eaten a trout or another pike, something. Lovely fish. Stunning fish. After a quiet night, I wake up to a special sunrise, with the mist rolling in over the loch. However, after fishing through the day without any interest, I decide to roll the dice at a new spot as the weather starts to turn for the worse. With the light fading, I don't have much time. I've got a fish! Quick!